so I'll be showing you guys how to connect this float switch. So if you look here, you notice we have three three wires here. So each of these wire, one is common, one is normally closed, and the other one is normally open. So we want to connect this <coughs> flow switch in a way that when the water is full, the flow switch will go up and then it will disconnect power to the motor. So we are going to make use of the normally closed part of this. So we we'll select our um, our own meter to continue to. So let's see continuity. Then we we'll check which of this cable, which of this wire is normally open. Okay, normally close to this. So this is normally open. This is normally close. You can hear that the sound. So this is normally open. This is normally close. So when this thing plays up, you see that the sound, the resistance works. So if you are testing with this other one, this is for normally open. So there is no continuity until the switch goes up, then you hear the buzzing sound. So that's how it is. So you will connect your life to this place and then your output will be to either normally open or normally close. So at this point we use normally close. Okay. 